Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Cybel Explains. This video is all about the visibility rules for 4 and 8. Let us have the visibility rules for 4. Which of these three numbers is divisible by 4? And how will we know that a number is divisible by 4? A number is divisible by 4 if it ends with two zeros or the last two digits is divisible by 4. Let us check if the first number, 41,859, is divisible by 4 by. By checking the last two digits, and we have here 59. Let's divide if it is divisible by 4. 59 divided by 4. How many 4s are there in 5? That's 1. 1 times 4 is 4. Subtract. 5 minus 4 is 1. Bring down 9. How many 4s are there in 19? That's 4. 4 times 4 is 16. 19 minus 16 is equal to 3. We have a remainder of 3. It means 41,859 is not divisible by 4. Let's check. The second number, 34,700. Automatically, this number is divisible by 4 because it ends with two zeros. Making 34,700 divisible by 4. Let's go to the third number. Let's check if the last two digit is divisible by 4. This number is 17,384 and we have the last two digits, 84. Okay, let's divide that. 84 divided by 4. How many 4s are there in 8? That's 2. 2 times 4 is 8. Let's subtract. Okay, bring down 4. How many 4s in 4? 1. 4 times 1 is 4. Subtract. We have no remainder. It means 17,384 is divisible by 4. Now, let's have divisibility rules for 8. Which do you think among these numbers is divisible by 8? A number is divisible by 8 if it ends with 3 zeros or the last 3 digits is divisible by 8. Let us check the first number. We have here 17,848 and the last 3 digits is 848. So, let's divide that. 848 divided by 8. How many 8s are there in 8? That's 1. 1 times 8 is 8. Bring down 4. How many 8s are there in 4? None. It's 0. 0 times 8 is 0. It's 4 minus 0 is 4. Bring down 8. How many 8s are there in 48? That's 6. 6 times 8 is 48. We don't have a remainder. It means this number, 17,848, is divisible by 8. Let us check the second number, 93,600. And the last three digits is 600. Let's divide that by 8. 600 divided by 8. How many 8s are there in 6? I think there's none. We move to 60. How many 8s are there in 60? That's 7. 7 times 8 is 56. 60 minus 56 is 4. Bring down 0. How many 8s are there in 40? That's 5. 5 times 8 is equal to 40. And we don't have a remainder. It means this number, 93,600, is also divisible by 8. How about the third number? 15,000. Automatically, this number is divisible by 8 because it ends with three zeros. We don't need to divide that. So we can say that 15,000 is divisible by 8. We're done. Let us have some exercises. We will be checking the column if the given number is divisible by 4 or 8. Let's have number 1. 40,500. Is it divisible by 4? Yes, because it ends with two zeros. Automatically, it is divisible by 4. How about number 2? 48,294. Is 94 divisible by 4? Let's check. Let's divide that. 94 divided by 4. How many 4s are there in 9? That's 2. 2 times 4 is equal to 8. Subtract. 
9 minus 8 is equal to 1. Bring the 4. How many 4s are there in 14? That's 3. 3 times 4 is equal to 12. If we're going to subtract 14 and 12, the answer is 2. We have a remainder. It means 48,294 is not divisible by 4. So it's x. Next, is 160,000 divisible by 4? Yes, because it ends with two zeros. It means this is divisible by 4. Let's continue. For number 1, is 40,500 divisible by 8? We'll check the last three digits. That's 500 divided by 8. Let's divide. How many 8s are there in 50? That's 6. 6 times 8 is equal to 48. Let's subtract. For 50 minus 48 is equal to 2. Bring down 0. How many 8s are there in 20? That's 2. 2 times 8 is equal to 16. We'll subtract. 20 minus 16 is equal to 4. We have a remainder of 4, making this number not divisible by 8. So 40,500 is not divisible by 8. For number 2, is 48,294 divisible by 8? Let's check the last three, 3 digits. Let's divide 294 divided by 8. How many 8s are there in 29? That's 3. 3 times 8 is equal to 24. 29 minus 24 is 5. Bring down 4. How many 8s are there in 54? 6. 6 times 8 is 48. Okay, just subtract. 4 minus 8 cannot be. We'll borrow from 5. That becomes 4. And 4 will become 14. 14 minus 8 is equal to 6. And we have a remainder. It means 48,294 is not divisible by 8. For the last number, 160,000. Is it divisible by 8? Yes, because it ends with 3 zeros. Automatically, that is divisible by 8. And we're done. Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!